These trees just kept growing larger and larger until they became the thickest trees ever discovered on Earth. Join me as we take a look at 15 of the widest and thickest trees ever found. Number 15. Monkira Monster, Australia When you start talking about the world's thickest trees, there are actually two things you can be talking about. The broadness of their crowns, or the widest spread of the limbs from a single trunk, or the stoutness or diameter of the trunk itself. As such, we've decided to start off our list with a few examples of trees with ridiculously broad crowns, and this Monkira monster is certainly a fine example of that. An example of the Kuliba or Eucalyptus microtheca, the crown of this monster in the Nira Gully waterhole, southwestern Queensland, Australia, had a diameter of 239 feet when it was last measured back in 2014. Data on greatest crown spread is somewhat limited, and it's not measured as often as height and trunk girth, but at the same time, the Mankura monster was the largest ever recorded. In 1857, a rain tree in Venezuela was measured to have a crown spread of 207 feet. And as it was still reportedly living, it may be a serious contender to take away Monkira Monster's crown. But as it's also in poor health, it's safe to say that this mammoth tree is still reigning supreme. Number 14. Corsham Court, Oriental Plain, Wiltshire, UK The Oriental Plain, or Plantanus Orientalis, has a spread of 210 feet, leading it to be identified as the most spreading tree in the UK. Taking up approximately as much room as a football pitch, this plain at Corsham Court near Chippenham in Wiltshire was planted by master landscape gardener Lancelot Capability Brown in 1760 and stretches out so wide that its lowest branches actually rest on the ground. In fact, some of them have even taken root. Originating in the Middle East, this tree was planted as a specimen at the privately owned stately home, and its incredible branches have absolutely no man-made supports at all. James Bethune Campbell, the current occupant of Corsham Court, has said that it's, quote, extraordinary that it's standing without falling down, end quote. And you only have to take one look at these images to find yourself completely in agreement with him. Not to mention, Owen Johnson, the registrar at the UK Tree Register, says, it extends in each direction with branches like elephant trunks snaking across the ground. It's a very confusing tree. Number 13, Shugborough Yew, Staffordshire, England. England may not be known for the highest trees in the world, or for even trees with the largest diameter of trunk, but they certainly have their fair share of trees with an outstandingly wide spread. Here's another example from Shugborough Hall, Staffordshire, England, which is a giant 350-year-old European yew, or Taxus baccata, with a canopy the size of Royal Albert Hall. Recently entering the record books as the widest tree in the UK, this specimen has a crown circumference of almost 200 yards, which many believe could actually be the widest in all of Europe. The branches of the Shugborough Yew spreads out 50 meters further than its nearest rival, which may have something to do with the fact that it spent most of its life growing sideways rather than upwards, just like our previous entry. Some of the branches this yew have started rooting themselves into the ground and engulfing other trees nearby. Given that yews can live for over a thousand years, it's conceivable that if left to its own devices, the tree could eventually cover the entire estate. Number 12. Pachanga Great Oak, California Next, we're hopping across the pond to the United States with this incredible example of a coast live oak, or Quercus agrifolia, in the Pechanga National American Reservation east of Temecula, California. With a spread of 176 feet, the great oak, known as Wi'a'asal by the Pechanga people, is recognized as the largest example of its kind in the country. Its trunk alone has a circumference of over 20 feet, and the tree itself is nearly 100 feet tall. At over a thousand years old, this great oak is also one of the oldest living oak trees in the western United States, and it's located in an area once known as Great Oak Ranch, which once bordered the land granted to the Pechanga people in 1882. In 2001, however, the tribe purchased Great Oak Ranch, along with the thousand acres surrounding it, which is how the tree came by its current title of the Pechanga Great Oak. This tree certainly provides a link to the past, not least because even at its great age, it still produces acorns, which are an essential food for native Californians thousands of years before Europeans even thought about making their way into the New World. Number 11. Tematui Nahiri, New Zealand Now we're going to move on to trees that boast some of the thickest trunks in the world, and the first of these is Tematui Nahiri. With a trunk diameter of 17 and a half feet, the Maori name of this giant kauri coniferous tree in the Waipaua Forest, New Zealand, translates as Father of the Forest. 
It's not only believed to be the second largest living kauri tree, but also have the biggest girth of any tree in the country. Some estimates place that the tree is between 1,200 and 2,000 years old, whereas others claim that it's between 2 and 3,000 years old. And others still put the age at this tree at well over 4,000 years old, with National Geographic suggesting that it may even be the oldest tree in New Zealand. Sadly, however, Tematua Nahiri suffered severe damage in 2007 due to extreme winter storms, which is expected to shorten its lifespan by hundreds of years. But hey, as lifespans go, 4,000 years isn't bad. Number 10. Lake Quinault Spruce, Washington This Sitka spruce is located in Olympic National Park, Washington State, in the United States, and has a trunk girth of 17.7 .7 feet. Lake Quinault is known as the Valley of the Rainforest Giants, and this magnificent spruce is one of them. Not only that, but officially, the world's largest spruce with an overall circumference of 58 feet and a height of 191 feet, so it deserves to be on this list for several reasons. It was almost beaten to the title by another unfeasibly large spruce near Seaside, Oregon, although this tree was awarded a mere 902 points by the American Forestry Association, compared to the Quinault Lake spruce 922. They must have been feeling generous, though, because they declared the trees close enough to be co-champions. Although, sadly, the seaside spruce fell after a winter storm back in 2007, leaving the Quinault Lake spruce as the uncontested champion. Number 9. Troll, Australia When you hear that a tree has the nickname Troll, you don't even really need to see it to take a guess that it's probably pretty enormous. With a trunk radius of 19.1 feet and a height of 183 feet, this huge alpine ash, or Eucalyptus delegatennis, grew in a patch of impenetrable rainforest in Tasmania, Australia. This area of the rainforest also included horizontal scrub, which has an unusual feature in that it falls over once the crown reaches a certain height and grows new limbs from the now horizontal trunk, which then creates a tangled collection of floor-based trunks that end up looking like a giant moss-covered octopus. And this is what made the place so impenetrable, because if you did want to gaze at the massive glory of Troll, then you'd find yourself clamoring over slippery branches, sometimes five meters in height. It's hardly suitable for a relaxing family hike. Number 8. Quinault, Big Cedar, Washington Okay, we're back to Lake Quinault again, but this time with a massive western red cedar with a trunk girth of 19 and a half feet. After captivating the hearts and minds of everyone who saw this giant for generation after generation, this mighty spruce finally met its end in July 2016, due to what doctors could probably call natural causes or old age. In its day, however, it stood at 174 feet tall with a reach of 61 feet. It was nearly impossible to catch in a single photograph. Despite that, the public couldn't get enough of it and would frequently gather for photos around it and even inside the ill-fated giant. But the fact that the Quinnell Big Cedar was hollow wasn't a good sign, as it was clearly deteriorating, and obviously only a matter of time until it was knocking on heaven's door. On a positive note, though, this tree now lives on the forest floor, providing much-needed food for the next generation of insanely thick-trunked, bark-covered giants. Number 7. Herbage Family Tree, Australia at 24 meters tall, this unusual-looking red gum tree isn't anywhere near as big as some of the other examples on this list, but it has a trunk girth of 23 feet, so it unequivocally belongs here on our list of widest and thickest trees. It's located in Springton, South Australia. The Herbage family tree is completely hollow and estimated to be about 3 to 500 years old. The tree is the only tree on our list that's ever been used as a family home. 27-year-old Friedrich Herbridge arrived in Australia in 1855, and by 1858 he was married to 18-year-old Caroline, so decided to do what every young, ambitious, newly married man does and invite her to live in his tree home. Amazingly, she accepted and even gave birth to two of her children while living there, at which point the family felt they needed to upgrade and build a stone cottage next to the tree. To this day, the Herbridge family still holds family reunions at the tree every five years. Number 6. Kamono Okuso, Japan. With a trunk diameter of 27 feet, this Chinese camphor tree is at least 1,500 years old and has a variety of tales and legends associated with it. And to be fair, it does kind of look like the thing you'd expect to stumble across in a fairy tale. Located on the grounds of the Hachimanjinja Shinto Shrine and standing at a height of 30 meters, Kamono Okusha has been classified as a national monument of Japan since 1952. 
Not only that, but the hollow interior of the tree boasts an area of around 13 square meters, which was once a popular resting place for homeless people, and a play area for the children at the school next door, although a locked door was installed to restrict access back in the year 2000. To this day, the local townspeople still take care of the tree, particularly since it was damaged by fierce typhoons in 97 and 2004, no doubt due to its strong links to the area and the country's history. Number 5. The Rikeli Baobab Not far from the village of Rikeli, southwest of Madagascar, is a sacred tree, the giant baobab. Just look at the size of this thing. With a trunk circumference of a whopping 75 feet, this baobab is surrounded by a grove of smaller trees, almost like they're protecting their special family member and treating it with the same reverence that the locals have been doing over centuries. You see, according to legend, the people of the Zanakang clan used to hide inside this tree back in the 12th century in order to escape the attentions of the hostile Fahavalo clan. And if the stories and legends aren't alone enough to make this tree extra special, it's also the largest known tree in Madagascar. Also called the Big Za of Ampanahi, this baobab tree is home to hundreds of bats, cockroaches, and a variety of other weird and wonderful creatures, not least of which is the Madagascar ground boa, which supposedly lives underneath it. Number 4. General Grant, California for our next entry, we're heading back to California with another tree which boasts a 29-foot trunk diameter. General Grant is a giant sequoia located in Kings Canyon National Park, California, in the appropriately named General Grant Grove. This tree is so important they named the entire grove after him. General Grant is around 1,650 years old, and it's not only the second largest giant sequoia tree in the world, but also has the third largest footprint of any living giant sequoia. Although General Grant's brother in bark-covered hugeness, General Sherman, is slightly larger, its girth still isn't as impressive as Grant's, which is why he's on our list and Sherman isn't. Tough break, Sherman. The tree was named after 18th President of the United States Ulysses S. Grant back when he was a not-so-humble Army General, and various presidents have been very fond of it over the years. President Calvin Coolidge proclaimed it the nation's Christmas tree, or as President Dwight D. Eisenhower declared it a national shrine to those who died in war. Clearly, one of the few trees to regularly rub shoulders with the rich and influential. Number 3. Captain Jack Sparrow, California with a slightly bigger trunk girth than General Grant at 29.2 feet, this massive coast redwood is also located in California at the Redwood National Park. Named after one of Johnny Depp's most famous characters, this officially is the widest tree known in the United States. First discovered back in 2010 by M.D. Vaden and Thomas Hahn, this unfeasibly massive tree is known by two names, Captain Jack Sparrow by Vaden and Hahn and Jupiter by John Montague of Save the Redwoods League who was the first person to measure it. Plant biology PhD student Zane Moore also measured Captain Jack, and given his research into albino redwoods seems to be widely known and respected, his confirmation of the tree's hugeness was welcomed by giant redwood fanciers everywhere. Number 2. Sunland Baobab, South Africa We couldn't really have a list of the widest and thickest trees without having more than one appearance of the incredible baobab. This particular baobab lives at Sunland Farm, Limpopo, South Africa, and has a trunk diameter of a ridiculous 34.9 feet. Also known as the Platland baobab, Muketsi baobab, tree bar, big baobab, or pub tree, the Sunland baobab has been carbon dated to just over a thousand years old, plus or minus 75 years. But however many centuries this goliath of a tree has been standing, surely the most bizarre episode in its life was in 1993 the owners of Sunland Farm decided to build a bar inside its massive trunk complete with seats, draft beer, and a music system. It soon became a popular tourist destination, with 60 people once attending a party inside. And let's just think about that for a minute. 60 people inside a tree. That's one serious trunk. Given so much drinking and partying was done on the inside of this tree, it's no surprise that part of it died in 2016, and the bar itself was destroyed in 2017 when the tree split, as if to say, get the hell out of my trunk. Number 1. Arbol del Tule, Mexico And the winner is this gargantuan Montezuma Cypress with an eye-watering trunk diameter of 38.1 feet. Located in Santa Maria del Tule, Oaxaca, Mexico, an arbol de tule, which is Spanish for the tree of tule, is officially the stoutest tree trunk in the world and has even been placed on a UNESCO tentative list of World Heritage Sites. In fact, this thing is so big that scientists weren't entirely sure that it was one tree at all and thought it could potentially be several. 
However, after several DNA tests, it's well and truly been confirmed. This is one big tree. Nobody really knows how old this tree might be, which provides an added layer of mystery, but it's been estimated that it could have been around for as long as 6,000 years. According to local legend, however, it was planted 1,400 years ago by Pechochka, a priest of the Aztec wind god. And there was a strange logic to this theory, because sure enough, it does stand on a sacred site, which was later taken over by the Catholic Church. It's also known as the Tree of Life because of the images of animals people claim to be able to see in the bark of its record-breaking trunk. Well, there's certainly plenty of room to see as many animals as you can imagine. Watch our nature playlist for more top 15 videos about beautiful nature. Sit back, relax, and binge watch all of our best nature videos.